the European Union on October 27, 2023, delivered 105 military vehicles to Ghana in a bid to help the country face the jihadist threat from the Sahel region. The donation was made under the European Union's Conflict Prevention, Peace, and Security Policy, which aims to support African countries in addressing security challenges. Welcome to our YouTube channel. Today, we bring you an important news update from Ghana, where the European Union has stepped in to address the rising jihadist threat from the Sahel region. In a significant move, the European Union has delivered 105 military vehicles to Ghana to bolster its security forces. Join us as we delve into the details of this development, exploring the implications for Ghana's security and the broader fight against terrorism in the Sahel. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay informed about the latest news and updates. The vehicles, which include armored personnel carriers, ambulances, and trucks, were handed over to the Ghanaian military during a ceremony in Accra, the country's capital. The European Union ambassador to Ghana, Urchid Raza Ali, said the donation was a sign of the European Union's commitment to supporting Ghana's security efforts. This donation is a testament to the strong partnership between the European Union and Ghana, Raza Ali said. It is also a demonstration of the European Union's commitment to supporting Ghana's efforts to address the security challenges facing the country and the region. Ghana's Defense Minister, Dominic Nidiwal, thanked the European Union for the donation, saying it would help the country to better counter the threat of jihadist terrorism. These vehicles will help us to strengthen our border security and to respond more effectively to terrorist threats, Nidiwal said. We are grateful to the European Union for this timely support. The delivery of the military vehicles comes at a time when Ghana is facing an increasing threat from jihadist groups operating in the Sahel region. In recent years, there have been several attacks on Ghanaian security forces and civilians by jihadist groups such as Al-Qaeda in the Islamic Maghreb and the Islamic State in the Greater Sahara. The European Union's donation of military vehicles is a welcome boost to Ghana's security efforts. The vehicles will help the country to better protect its borders and to respond more effectively to terrorist threats. This is essential for maintaining peace and security in Ghana and in the wider region. In addition to the donation of military vehicles, the European Union is also supporting Ghana's security efforts through several other initiatives. These include providing training to Ghanaian security forces, supporting the development of Ghana's national security strategy, and helping to improve intelligence sharing between Ghana and other countries in the region. The European Union's support of Ghana is part of its wider efforts to address the security challenges facing the Sahel region. The European Union has also provided support to other countries in the region, such as Mali, Burkina Faso and Niger. The European Union's support is essential for helping these countries to counter the threat of jihadist terrorism and to build more peaceful and stable societies. Thank you for tuning in to our coverage of the European Union's delivery of 105 military vehicles to Ghana in the face of the jihadist threat from the Sahel. This strategic move highlights the commitment to enhancing security and combating terrorism in the region. To stay up to date with the latest news, analysis, and updates on global security issues, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. By subscribing, you'll be part of our growing community and receive regular notifications about our thought-provoking videos. We encourage you to share your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below and engage in meaningful discussions. Together, let's stay informed and work towards a safer world.